So in this video, I'm going to demonstrate on how to change the uh, name of the store on a CL5500. And what do we mean by store? So let me just put something on the scale here and pull up my PLU number one, which happens to be meat. And then we print the label and this is what it looks like, right? So you have this, uh, these characters, let me just print another one. So the line is gone, but the characters are still there. And how do you rename that with the store name? So this is what we're talking about here. To do that, we go into the menu and then we scroll down by clicking on this PLU button, but also it's an arrow down button, right? And then we go into a number four, which is a store data table, right? And then we go into a number one, which is a store. Okay, one. And here we do um, new or edit store, which is one again. All right. And we already have a store name, which is one. Right. And, and then I'm going to go down and see it, it shows us this right there. And then we can just use this keyboard. Let me type in CSI. Uh, space works w o r k s all right and then we'll do our phone number um, so eight five eight three two nine nine one nine zero let's say that's our number and now we hit save okay and so now we just want to get out of this menu by clicking this x a bunch of times and so now we're out and so let's see if it happened so one two print so it's actually you need like a two labels to do this so let me just print the second one right away so grab this one and uh, so it's there there it is but uh let me just print this one more time and we get a clean print so 619-858-329-919 so there it is that's how you change the store name on your label thank you